Hello Postcrossers, this is another Sunday video of my weekly postcards received during the week. This week I received a very nice pile of postcards and letters. And before I start showing you what I received, I ask you to subscribe the channel, leave some comments, leave some likes on this video or on the other videos and invite your friends if they are postcrossers or if they like receiving postcards, letters, snail mail. Let's start showing you and the first postcard came from Finland. I haven't received lately postcards from Finland but this this postcard is very funny and very cute. It's a kitty with some snow and some postcard with glitter. I don't know if you can see the stars shining. It's some glitter. And this postcard was written by Anne. She's a 58 years old woman and she has two dogs and she likes reading books and traveling and the, the stamps are cool one bird and one uh, man riding uh, ostrich i think it's the name in english ostrich i don't know please tell me how do you say this bird this um, yes, this bird uh, in English. So thank you, Anne, for your postcard. The next one came from Russia. Uh, the person who wrote this Christmas funny postcard it was Valentina. And she also put some sticker an umbrella sticker and a common Russian stamp. So, Valentina, thank you for your funny Christmas postcard. From Czech Republic, I received this one. Came on an envelope with some free stuff inside. Let me show you. Okay. To start very nice and beautiful stamps for my father's collection then she sent me a yummy tea from forest fruits here i will drink it soon then and she also sent me this aroma from saying with a shape of a stamp from Jessica po Posta smells very good and finally she sent me a very cool draw she draw very well I like it it's it's a dinosaur I think it could be a Pokemon, I don't know. Tell me on the comments if it could be a Pokemon or not. And finally, she sent me this postcard, an Epi Post Crossing postcard. And I have to thank to Alice. Alice, thank you for all the stuff you sent me. Let's move on. To another official one this came this one came from India it's more or less a rare country these days um, and the person who sent me this postcard uh, was mr. Varshna and he sent me this postcard and this is the one of the most ancient church European church in India. Very cool postcard. 
and when I looked this postcard for the first time, I thought it was a postcard from Portugal because we have many churches like this one. So thank you, Mr. Varshna, for your postcard. And uh, in Asia, I also received a postcard from Taiwan. The person who, who sent me was Sherry and she sent me a postcard from a Japanese animation series. This is now very famous in Japan and worldwide. It's Jujutsu Kaisen. And this one is one of the most important character, characters in the series. And thank you for the postcard, Sherry. And I like Jujutsu Kaisen, especially the manga. I like the animation, but I always prefer manga. So thank you again for your postcard. And the last official one, it was a very special postcard because um, I received from Portugal, but the content of the postcard make my heart broken and I cry a little when I finish reading it because you know what's happening in the world because the Russian and Ukraine war and this postcard I never thought that a postcard from Post Crossing could make me cry a little. The postcard is this one. It's a, a, a vintage illustration. And the postcard was sent by Sasha. She's Ukrainian. And I hope she don't mind that I will read her postcard, but my heart says to read it. So what she wrote was, Hello Fernando, my name is Sasha and I'm from Ukraine. I was in a short trip in Madrid when the war just started. After this day, I've moved to the Lisbon in Portugal and I start a new life here. People here are so kind and nice love Portugal, I love Portugal, Sasha, and this postcard I will never forget because what's happening these days on the world. So thank you Sasha for your postcard and I hope Portugal will be your home from now on. So Thank you very much for your postcard and for those strong words. Thank you, Sasha. <sighs> let's move on. And now let's go to the surprise postcards. I received another postcard from Brazil, from another post crossing online meeting. And it's this one. It's also a special postcard because this postcard and this and this virtual meeting in Conto Virtual is virtual meeting in Portuguese. This postcard was sent by my lovely friend Luzia and this postcard was in 2022 of February uh, 20, 2022. So this is a virtual meetup of palindrome and ambigram date so it's a very cool and commemorative uh, postcard and look here many person were in this virtual meeting so i thank you all to the participants for your postcard and i hope to have time to go to a virtual meeting with them so thank you guys for your postcard 
and I will say it now in Portuguese. Muito obrigado, Luzia, pelo teu postal. E em breve enviarei também um, não de um encontro virtual, mas de algo que eu encontre e que faça uh, gosto na tua, na tua coleção. And the last snail mail I have to show you came from Russia again. And it's a mail art for my Alice in Wonderland uh, call. Uh, this person has already sent it in by email, but I said to her to send s at least one illustration in snail mail. And she decided to send not one, but four illustrations. And they are very, very beautiful. Look here. The draws are awesome. Look this one. This is her interpretation of Alice in Wonderland. And the person who make these draws is Irina um, Irina Novikova. So Irina, thank you again for your participation. Thank you for your illustrations in Alice in Wonderland uh, mail art call and also in PES, Blister PES mail art. And that's all. That was what I received this week. So bye bye and happy post crossing.